Hey everyone, welcome back to Twitch Beard. I'm Twitch, and today I will be uh, talking about gray before shave. Uh, so a while back I had bought some oils that I uh, was looking to um, try out, the gray before shave uh, products. Um, I've heard good things about them, so I finally went and uh, got some. I found them on Amazon, uh, they're decently priced. Uh, even on their website, uh, the bottles of beard oil are 12 bucks, um, or two for 22. Uh, so it's actually really good, uh, decent price. Um, so I have no complaints as far as that, and the scents um, are actually pretty good too. Um, so for starters, I uh, was looking to get the uh, Caramel Mocha. Um, and then the artwork is really cool too. Maybe you can see that. I'm filming this off my phone, so I know the quality on the zoom is not very good. Um, but that's the uh, Great Before Shave Caramel Mocha. So that's the uh, Mocha Aftertones in it. Um, and the ingredients in all of them, guys, are straight across the board uh, for the three that I'll show you. It's tea tree oil, pure apricot oil, jojoba oil, sweet almond oil, vitamin E, aloe vera, and some essential oils, which I'm guessing is what they get in the uh, smells, scents uh, into the oils with. Um, but it smells really good though. Like you could really smell coffee. Um, so it really smells like coffee, which is really cool. Um, and these, I see, uh, I don't know how many else these are. I want to say these are probably just one ounce containers. It doesn't say on here, uh, but I believe they are one ounce. Um, again, um, it smells really good. Um, this one happens to have a pump, which I actually don't like at all because you can't really tell how much you're gonna pump. You barely press it and you get like a few drops at once. So you really have to be super careful when you pump them uh, because if not, you're gonna get like a handful if you, uh, you know, pump too fast or you know too many times so I definitely did not like the fact that it came with the pump style um, top however I, I think they do sell them in other in droplet forms too in uh, droplet type bottles uh, because this one came with droplet and this is the bay rum and again that's a cool real artwork that they have this one's got a pirate on it so this one's the bay rum it has the coconut aftertones and this one's really good like after you take a shower it just really feels real refreshing what I liked about it and it smells really good though like I, I don't really smell too much coconut in it that's just me um, I smell more of like I don't know it smells to me it almost reminds me of barbershop just a little bit um, but definitely like on a cool uh, hot summer day um, you know take a shower put some of this in there uh, definitely you know um, feels really good so I definitely enjoyed this one's probably my favorite out of all three that I've got here um, again, this one definitely has the um, droplet, which I liked. I liked the most. It looks just a little more control over how much product you're, you're putting in your hand, which I like. And the consistency of them, they're not too thick and they're not too thin either. <laughs> I'd say they're pretty decent consistency. Um, so, you know, that's always a good thing. I um, don't want too thin, then you have to use too much, too thick. Uh, you know, then you have to be careful because if you use too much, then it doesn't. Um, you know absorb as well sometimes I mean the last one I have here is the um, cigar blend which is cigar and vanilla that's the vanilla undertones and this one uh, I haven't used as much um, I've used Bayram the most to be honest uh, I like that scent the most um, again it just feels real refreshing when you put it on um, so that's probably why I liked it um, but this one is the cigar blend and again, the cool little artwork that they have I actually really enjoy that um, I don't know why, but <laughs> the bottles are pretty cool. Um, and then on the side, they do show you the ingredients on each one. There's a great for shave logo right there. Um, and then the ingredients right there. And then directions, which I can't really read them very well. Uh, they're a little small. It says, use the dropper to dispense a dime-sized amount of great before shave uh, beard oil into the palm of your hand. Uh, for longer or fuller beards, use the dro uh, dropper to apply the beard oil directly to the skin underneath the beard. Gently work the oil into your beard, go to your mustache, groom and style your beard as normal using a four bristle brush or comb. Uh, rinse excessive oil from your hand with warm soapy water. Um, so let's you know, just give you some directions. I know it says the droplet, this one comes again with the pump. Um, so they probably aren't going to change the labels to accommodate that, which, I mean, I don't think they need to. Um, but, I mean, you get the point. Pump it, it comes out. Don't pump too much. If you get too much in your hand, might waste it. Um, so definitely this one you can't get directly into your beard with this style. 
um, which is another thing like if you like to do that then this one's definitely not going to work for you uh, but again uh, i definitely like the product it leaves your uh, beard feeling nice hydrated smooth uh, smooth to the touch like it definitely feels really good uh, after using them for about a week um, i definitely felt like you know my beard was getting uh, smoother um, hydrated um, so i definitely did like the product i enjoyed them a lot and i definitely will continue buying them these are definitely in part of my rotation um, hopefully soon I can get some other butter. I've heard good things about it. So when I do, you guys will know. I'll let you guys, uh, let, I'll let you guys know what I think about it and I'll do another review on that. But for now, um, thanks for watching and go ahead, hit that subscribe button, um, hit the like button, bell notification so you don't miss out on my next video. Um, follow me on Instagram at twitchbeard. Um, and you can always buy one of the hats that I have at, uh, twitchbeard.com as well. Um, so yeah, there you go. Thank you guys for watching and stay safe, stay fresh, most importantly, stay bearded.